Days of distraction lie ahead. The NCAA men's basketball tournament starts tomorrow. And as Local 12 Sydney Venter tells us, worker productivity might be down, but spending is up, Sydney. Yeah, Rob, advertisers are banking on the fact that you'll watch. Employers, though, hoping you don't, at least not while you're on their dime. There's a lot riding on how plugged in you are to the madness. Before March Madness reaches critical mass, college basketball fans have already dipped into their pockets and not just for office pools. Maybe buying a new flat screen TV and of course the parties and those brackets. So it is a big spending sport, much higher than you might anticipate. A spending sport that costs fans and employers alike. Bracketology takes time after all. The first couple days of games alone could cost businesses as much as $1.9 billion. More than a quarter of people surveyed say being at work won't stop them from tuning into the games. It's not just work that suffers, but workouts. A third of people surveyed say they'll ditch the gym to watch. With so many fans making sacrifices to follow along with the action, it's no wonder advertisers fork out big bucks for TV spots. One estimate puts that number at more than $1.1 billion. It's a lot of time and money, but at least it's only temporary madness. These games really are all-encompassing. Thankfully, they are only 21 days long, so things should hopefully return back to normal after the final game. So what lengths will you go to to make sure that you don't miss any March Madness action? Well, we asked our friends on Facebook, and here's what a few of you had to say. Shannon says, I take the first two days off the tournament, off of work, I should say. Tim says, by far my favorite time of year and my favorite sport. Love March Madness. I'll have it on in the background at work. And Linda says, absolutely no lengths at all. What is March Madness? LOL. She's clearly joking. You can head over to Local12.com and fill out your own bracket. I'll have mine in the pool so you can play against me and other folks here at Local12. Rob? Sydney, thanks very much. The play-in games start tomorrow in Dayton, and the big dance gets underway on Thursday. And you can catch the Bearcats taking on Purdue Thursday night, 710 is the time, followed by the Kentucky game, both here on Local12.